A man went missing from Vermilion County more than two years, two months ago. One person has been arrested in connection to the disappearance of Richard Truitt. Now they're facing new charges. We sent WCI 3's Abigail Metch to investigate further. She joins us now. So Abigail, what did you learn? Well, today I got hold of court documents that say Michelle Ingram has been charged with stabbing Richard Truitt. I spoke with Chum and Truitt's friends who told me that his, he was Ingram's landlord and that he was with Ingram the night that he disappeared. Richard Truitt was last seen on the night of December 27, 2020. He got into a car just outside of his home in Westville. Friends say it's not like him to leave the house without letting someone know. Rich never left the house without telling his mom, I'm going here, I'm going there. He was with a woman named Michelle Ingram. The morning after Truett disappeared, Ingram was picked up by the police when she showed up at his best friend's house. She kicked in my back door and proceeded to tell me a few things that I didn't like um, to where we ended up in a scuffle. She hit me, and I called the police. Jamie Allison was on the phone with Truett's mom when Ingram broke in and recalled something Ingram said to her before police arrived. So she said that she, she finished him. Now, more than two months after Truett went missing, an arrest has been made. Michelle Ingram was originally charged with concealment of homicide. She has now been charged with stabbing Richard Truett. She's being held at Vermilion County Jail, but loved ones say there is more to uncover. I will be a little bit more at ease once he's home and the other people are picked up because I think there's more than just one. The Vermilion County Sheriff's Department is continuing to investigate this case. They say they're trying their hardest to bring closure to Truett's family. They encourage anyone with more information to come forward. Paul? All right, Abigail, thanks for that update.